Hi guys. Uh, today we are going to learn like how to extend the LV partition in Linux. Okay. So there are two cases here. If the space is available in VG, there is one process. And if the space is available, uh, I, I mean, if the space is not available in VG, there will be one process. Okay. These two things we are, we are going to discuss. Okay. Let's see uh, like uh, how to uh, extend the space uh, LVM partition space if the space is available in the VG first, then we'll come to the other point later. Okay. So here, see guys, if you have a disk, right? So uh, if you have a disk, right, you create a LVM partition here. I mean disk here and then PV and then VG, LV and then file system, right? So whatever the LV that I created, I wanted to extend. So which LV I wanted to extend that we need to see, right? So here, so PVS command if you run, you can see what all the PVS, VGS command if you run, what all the VGS, LVS command you can run, what are all the LVs, right? So here I wanted to extend the LV, Oracle data LV, right? So the requirement might get like slash etc fs tab okay so this is the file system that you need to extend slash or data so in this like slash or data okay you can clearly see that oracle lv is the lv or data lv is the lv right so if you run uh, lvs command okay oracle data oracle data or data lv is there in the database vg so we need to see whether space is available in the database vg or not right so if you see vgs command if you run you can see database vg how much space is available 10 gb available right so 40 gb was there 10 gb available 10 gb is free right so in this case what you need to do right so in this case what you need to do you need to check first whether um like how much gb that you want and whether space is available or not right now 10 gb is available right so for example only 5 gb required maybe 500 gb required the space is available in the vg what you need to do is directly you can extend lv lv extend without any downtime we can extend it it doesn't require any downtime of the file system or unmoding the file system and all we no need to do okay so this is extending the file system if space is available in the vg we can extend directly so lv extend is the command to extend the file system option capital l we can specify what is the like uh, how much gb that you want to extend for example i want to pick 50 percent free okay using small l we can also use small l if you are using capital l we can specify plus 100 gb free uh, plus 100 gb or plus 500 gb something like that right so if you are using small l you can use plus 50 percent free so 10 gb 50 percent means 5 gb something like that right so hyphen um, you can give the hyphen n name of the lv simple right so you no need to give name of the lv here directly you can give the lv path okay so what is the lv so oracle uh, v database vg okay database underscore vg and then what is the lv or data lv or data underscore lv simple right so lv is extending it because space is available in the vg right so give enter so lv is successfully resized right even like now it is resized you need to extend the file system also because you extended the like uh, lv right because vg space is available you need to extend a file system also right so out extend file system means this is xfs right xfs underscore grow fs is the command for extending the xfs file system okay slash dev so what is the file system uh, what is the data uh, what is the actual um the partition that we created extended this is the this is the partition right just give enter right so sorry grow fs it is grow fs grow fs is the command okay so it is successfully extended or no we need to give the space here sorry is okay so this is the command just give enter we are able to successfully extend right now if you see df hyphen hd command you can see it is uh, 35 gig earlier it was 30 gb right now if you run like lsblk you can see here 35 earlier it was only 30 okay now if you run uh, the mount command also like mount command is just like um, 
already mounted so we no need to check even we no need to run mount if any command because we are not checking we we haven't changed anything in the slash it is a fast app okay so if space is available this is how we can extend it and uh, okay so for example if space is available okay if you are using a hyphen or at the end okay it will run L, uh, it will run actually xfs underscore grow fs command okay directly so th that is the thing actually so you no need to run this command at all so you just need to use option all okay so that is how like you can extend the file system if space is available in the vg now i'll show you like if space is not available in the vg okay so next is for example um let's say uh lsblk so this is the partition right so that the, they asked right so 35 gb from which vg we created we need to run vgs command right database vg can clearly see that this is the vg and this is the vg and 5 gb it is there now i want like uh, 15 gb i want action for example 150 gb or uh, 1.5 tb right something like that i wanted action i don't have space if you don't have space again what you need to do you need to take the another disk and then create a pv extending the vg extending the lv extending the file system right something like that so you need to create a you need to take the new disk so we requested vmware team uh, they are adding a disk okay once they add a disk they will let you know that like okay disk is added you can you can start the you can extend the system something like that okay they, they are adding 20 gb here added now you need to run what echo command right to make it visible so if you run lsblk command you know you don't you won't be able to see hdc is not there right so what you need to do you need to run echo command echo hyphen 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 so double get run slash sys class skizzy underscore host host to zero slash scan okay and uh, for host one i am running host two i am running host to three i am running okay now if you run lsblk the disk is visible disk is visible we need to create a pv first right so first you need to do pv create slash dev slash sdc is the disk you need to extend a vg not creation we need to extend the same vg because already file just partition created right same vg from which vg the partition is created we need to extend this that vg right so slash dev what is the VG? Directly we need to give the VG name. Okay. So uh, VG extend VG name uh, database under database underscore VG and then PV. Right. So VG create here VG extend simple. Right. Enter. So you can see extended successfully extended. Now we need to extend LV. LV extend option capital L. So you need to provide the um, the size of the uh, I mean the size of the LV that you wanted to extend. So for example, I want to extend 15G, right? So 15G, because if you run VGS command now, you can see 24 GB is available because we just extended the VG, right? So we need to extend the LV using LV extend command, hyphen capital L plus 15 GB, 15 G, and you need to give the LV, right? So LV path actually, what is LV path? Slash dev slash VG name, database vg and then oracle data lv simple using hyphen capital r we can also extend the file system okay so we don't need to use xfs underscore grow fs okay see the uh, logical volume is successfully resized and the file system also successfully extended now if you run df hyphen hd command you can see the 15 gb is extended right and uh, 50 gb because earlier it was 35 now it is 15 plus 15 right 50 gb so lsbl also you can verify mount also you can verify okay something like this you can check it now so for example if that is ext4 file system okay if that is ext4 so what you need to do ext4 right so let's say like lsblk now i have the space 50 uh, uh, i mean vgs command so i have the space 90, 9 gb i'll just create a xfs file system to show you here okay um, um okay so what you need to do first we need to create lv right lv create hyphen capital l plus 50 uh, 5g okay plus 5g and then i need to give the name of the lv so mysql 
so mysql data underscore lv and then we need to give the database vg because from which vg we are creating it so we created now if you want to like uh, uh, convert into a file system mkfs dot ext4 because ext4 is a file system right so slash dev slash um what is the like uh, lv path so database vg mysql lv simple right so once you are done with this you need to add an entry in the vam slash etc fs tab so this so you can create it slash dev slash database underscore vg slash uh, mysql data underscore lv right slash mysql data is a uh, like a file system mysql data and exe4 is the file system defaults permissions 00, zero metadata backup file system checker during boot up i don't want to do okay so mount a if you run part uh, this is this one is not there this point is i mean mount point is not there i am creating it now if you run mount a nothing so mount command if you see it is mounted the last line right so if you see lsblk is also there and it is 5 gb right and uh, uh, mount uh, and df hyphen ht command also if you run right the same thing you can see it here if you want to extend this actually ax4 file system what you can do so you need to actually first we need to check the space in the vgs for example i want just 2 gb there is already 2 4 gb here so what i can do lv extend directly because space is available lv extend hyphen capital l plus uh, 2g right hyphen small l if you are using you can specify in percentages right plus 50 percent fee for example or 30 percent free 30 percent free okay and then uh, the name of the the path of the lv slash dev slash database v database underscore vg why is the lv my sql data underscore lv simple if you are giving option r it will run one command i don't want to give it because i'll run explicitly okay so successfully resize the partition is successfully resized this is actually file system xfs right uh, ext4 right because fs tab entry if you see this is the ext4 for ext4 we no need to run xfs underscore grow fs there is another command resize to fs command resize to fs slash dev slash vg name lv name something like this okay so something like this you need to you need to run actually so now blocking the long and all it, you can see uh, is mounted on right on resizing required something like that it is giving okay so it, it is successfully got extended something like that so you can also see here lv action if you if you don't want to give this command xfs underscore go fs command if you don't want to give that you can directly give this iphone or at the end okay for example i want to extend some more to gb what i can do resize to fs hyphen r okay so instead of giving this we can we can use this here hyphen r simple okay something like this okay so lsblk if you do uh, you can see 7.6 gb right and you can see df hyphen h capital d you can see like 7.4 g because 30 percent means it, it it's very less right earlier it was 4 gb um in 9 gb 30 percent like 7.4 it means 2.5 extra right something like that the same thing which you are, which was already ran here right extending right something like that okay so this is all about like file system uh, extending lvm partition and extending uh, if space is available in the vg and if space is not available in the vg okay Thank you for watching this video. Bye-bye.